What's up, Bubba? It's a little bit windy out here, so we're struggling right now. First morning in Mexico. away and it's a windy one it's fairly windy today it's fairly cold and a big moon and I just don't expect the deer to really be up and moving around for I don't know maybe another half an hour or so we didn't expect this but uh, it's part of it Bobby liked the look of the that big tall buck that we saw a couple nights ago and so we are back on that canyon trying to turn him up again we're gonna Steal glass and find some deer. I found three bucks and two does this morning already. So one little buck this morning on the drive in. It's hard to keep the glass still though. Stuff just going all over the place. So I'm just gonna pop him down to this next opening a couple hundred yards away. Let's see if I can turn something up from over there. My bullets are about to fly. <laughs> Only judge by God and the fruits that they've dropped. Left there to rot, all the weeds that they grew are never ending. They slave the whole human race, making dollars off our fate while your hands getting stained. Transaction time is all we got left. So count your cards and hold your breath. What a fool's state of mind. But hey, it's a paycheck, it's a paycheck. God only Well, population management. How are you feeling right now taking care of some of them coyotes down here, Bubba? Jay was out here a couple days ago and one of these was after a doe. So, kind of even the score a little bit. Even it up a little bit, huh? You didn't take your rifle? Yeah. I should take that thing too. We got a big white tail buck deer that Thomas is fitting to lay the smack down on, Bubba. It's a good one. Bubba and I just did a pretty big climb on top of a nipple, completely out of breath. Bobby's complaining that he drinks too much beer, which I can sympathize with. But we got up here and I'm glad we came because it's, it looks great. That is a lot of very, very good looking cruiser country. This is probably going to be horrible audio because the wind is still bad, but we found a shooter. He's a big 3x3, heavy 3x3, big eye guards, got kickers off both eye guards, and he's a, the only thing he's lacking is his G2s are a little small, but he's a solid buck. Chase is fitting to go make a stalk right now and get a little bit closer for Thomas on a white tail buck deer. What are you laughing at? You don't even know what I'm saying. See what I mean? Otra vez. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, I mean, he's pretty. I just don't know. Really, that's a tough decision. Bueno. Yeah. Going over here to pick up a deadhead at Josh's blast. It was uh, across the canyon. He blasted up early this morning. We've been watching a couple bucks and couldn't get on him, so I decided to come over here and pick it up for him. And then munched on a little bit. Not a bad buck at all. I don't see any evidence that it would be a lion. Oh, no bite marks on the head. We're going to do a little bit of Spanish 101 today, boys and girls. Hembra is doe. Macho is buck. Hembra and macho. That's your first lesson for today. Hope you all enjoyed it. Alright guys, quick update. The wind is still blowing. We uh, ran over to the other ridge, picked up that deadhead. It's pretty sweet. Um, while we were over there, <clears throat> Josh has been glassing this whole time and he just said that he picked up that good buck again. So we're gonna, Juan and I are gonna go down there and see if we can help locate him. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>
See the other deer down there? No fighting. Yeah. yeah. Like three more. Oh, wait, there's three of them yeah. right down there. Thomas. Excellent yeah, shot, Bubba. How do you feel about that Mexico <laughs> deer you just don't get? That may be the first time I ever killed a deer out of a pile of cow shit. Yeah. Adios, good morning. See you in the mañana. This is a good update. All right. Another update. Tom just shot that buck that Josh relocated. 217 yards and dropped him. Nice shooting there, Tom. Thank you. It's a nice buck, too. What just happened there, Bubba? We spent a few hours relocating the whitetail buck deer that Thomas had to put the hammer down on right now. We're feeling pretty good. All right, all right. Nice job finding him again. Yeah, we did. That was teamwork, for sure. <clears throat> See, he's got some cool eye guards. He's, uh, he's a good buck. I was ready to take the rifle and shoot him about 8 o'clock. <laughs> That's a big deer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's got three eye guards. Look at all this cool stuff. Yeah. That's a big deer. It's your offspring, Chase. Yeah. We'll get him set up for you, Tom. Get some photos. Cool. <laughs> Look at that, Bubba. All right, there. Congratulations. That's a big deer. That's a really good deer. Good work, I always get my face in the shadows when I have a hat on. <laughs> That big old Oregon smile there, Tom. There it is, Bubba. and I mean just a ton of really great kids your country and there's like I don't know I just saw three does and this morning we saw a couple of small bucks but mostly we've just been looking at trees which is nice they're pretty trees it's just not what we came here for um, good news is Chase and Tom killed a buck over on the other ranch. So we're going to go check that out here in a little bit after we uh, finish gouging our eyes out. In for a Saturday evening update. We just got back to the old ranch house, unpacked our stuff. We got this deer unloaded, about to gut it, cape it, and we're about to get on a carne asada. We got a new guy on the knife right now, his name's Chase. I don't know if he's ever done anything like this before, but he's attempting, he's making a crack at it. Yeah, I actually like full mount, my wife does, I should say I do, but my wife likes full mount. Mine so does too. She, uh, <laughs> I want to have her cat. That's going in the video. <laughs> That's on video, Bubba. Oh, yeah. oh shit. Look at that smile. Can't get it off his face. That's what happens when they don't have iPads and TVs. But if they do have iPads and TVs, you know what they should be watching. Mm-hmm.
Doing work. So 6 8. 13 and 1. So 116 and 6 8. What did you get? 3 8. Pretty damn close, gentlemen. Good job. Yeah, that's pretty close. Tom, how are you feeling right now, sir? I'm feeling wonderful. Pretty amazing. Yeah, I kept uh, drinking some rum. No, mezcal. 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 How about some bacanora, dude? <laughs> I don't think so. Oscar! No. <laughs> no. The giant coos bus. The giant coos bus. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty f smooth. Wow.